cold outside But the fire keeps us warm We can spend the night Underneath the mistletoe And I've gotten you a break Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel and thank you so much for coming back for another video. For those of you who decided to subscribe after my decor haul video, hey girl, hey, thank you so much for coming back for another video. Today is the day I am finally decking our halls with all the jolly and holly of Christmas today and I'm super duper excited to show you guys everything that I'm going to be doing and putting up. I actually have a couple of new so yeah I got me a cup of Christmas cheer also in a Christmas cup that I got from Dollar Tree. I'm really excited. I'm gonna go ahead and put on my Christmas tunes and of course put on some non-copyrighted music for you guys and yeah you guys go ahead and follow along as I decorate our home and let me know what you decided to do in your home down in the comments below and how you liked our home tomorrow it is christmas the first for you and me another year went by but the difference this time is that ever since july so first I'm starting off by putting on some YouTube and I am playing my favorite Christmas song ever and that is One More Sleep by Leona Lewis. If you guys haven't heard it then definitely check it out after this video. I highly recommend it. It's so beautiful and she did such a great job on it. So quickly I'm just clearing off the entertainment center so I can go ahead and take down our fall decor. Um, as you guys can see we do have a weird little gap area in the entertainment center and it shows all the outlets and I absolutely hate it. I don't like that about there. Um, I do plan on getting a wall mounted fireplace next year. So in a month or so maybe two months I don't know exactly when I'm going to get it but just to go ahead and fill up that space I think it'll look really nice in that area but until then that painting worked really well it's actually a fall painting and it was given to me by my mother-in-law and I just put some few pumpkins there and it filled up the space really nicely for what I needed it to do I wasn't too sure yet what I was going to do for Christmas I thought that this space was going to be bare until I had to go and buy a few more stuff at the store, but I did end up making it work with what I have. Um, next year, hopefully I do have the fireplace so I can do something different on there. Tops and I'm using the Mrs. Myers multi-purpose cleaning spray and I'm using it in the scent basil I actually went into Walmart to try to find the acorn spice scent but they did not have it but this one ended up working really nicely you guys I just love the smell of it it's kind of like a fresh scent but also a really sweet scent at the same time so yeah it smells really good <music> to the fun stuff and that is decorating. A bunch of the stuff you guys will see me use was from my decor haul video if you did watch that. If not, I will have it linked down in the description box below. That box full of Christmas decor is just a bunch of Christmas decor I had from last year. I had Corey bring it in the weekend prior. And those garlands you guys see me using, I did make them myself with a bunch of products I bought from Dollar Tree and Walmart. They both 
ended up costing $12, so $12 for the overall project. If you guys haven't seen that DIY video, I will have that link down in the description box below as well. But yeah, here I'm learning that Christmas decoration is so messy, so I'm going to be cleaning in the midst of decorating. You guys will see that just because I am using things with snow and glitter, so I do have a lot of fallback. Making our Christmas memories I've been working so much lately I can barely find the time to sleep Yeah, I spend my time running around Keeping people pleased But this is my favorite holiday It's a chance to start over new Cause I missed you so I'm letting go of everything but so right now I'm just cleaning one of those vases that I got from Goodwill. So I'm gonna fill up the bottom of it with a little bit of fake snow that I got from Hobby Lobby. The pack was $3.88 but I did get it for 50% off. I did not fill it up completely, just enough to cover up the stem of the tree. Around this time my fiance Corey did get home and I was really excited for him to see me in the process of decorating just so he can get a really good before and after because a little bit after this, my phone did end up dying, so I did not completely end up finishing the living room this night. I did get majority of it done. I did end up charging my phone a little bit and started back up, but I did finish everything the next day. I've been wrapping presents for you. I've been hanging marbles in the tree. And I've lit my house with Christmas lights, so you should come back home to me. And when we wake up in the morning I'm gonna play those carols that you love We'll be singing all the melodies in So my phone did die a little bit after the last scene So you guys didn't really get to see me I guess you can say finish the entertainment center what I did on the top, but most of what I have on there did not stay. I did end up changing things out the next day and so on and so forth. But as you guys can see, I did figure out what to do in that weird little section of our entertainment center. This basket, I did buy it for our fall decor and I did end up using it under our entryway table. Um, I will show you guys a little clip of that so you guys can see what I'm talking about But I had the smart idea to go ahead and put a Christmas a little Christmas tree over there And I did have this Christmas tree topper from our old Christmas tree We ended up leaving the rest of the body, but I still had the top so it worked perfectly for that It does light up, but I did not have enough outlets in there for me to always have it plugged in just you and nobody else It's so good to see you again So for those of you who are new, this is our kitty Layla and she is definitely a Christmas kitty. Last year was the first year we decorated for Christmas and I could tell that she was definitely into it. So when I brought out the Christmas decoration this year, she was definitely into watching me decorate just being in the mix. So you guys will see her in and out the video a lot just watching me and just being there in the intro outro she did not want to get out of the frame she was all about the camera time she wanted to make her debut for christmas so yeah you guys will see her a lot in this video today to clean 
line our coffee table with some furniture polish since it is wood and we did pick this one up from Goodwill for $25 you guys I cannot believe it it is an antique and it's so beautiful it does have two drawers in the front and that's why I absolutely fell in love with it but also because of how wide it is I feel like it just gives you so much room to decorate if you do want to go ahead and make your coffee table a little bit fancy but also having all that room is a little bit dangerous because you might go a little bit overboard as I kind of did here today but as you guys will see towards the end I did end up scaling things a little bit down because I did want to make things a little bit more I guess you can say clutter free and just clean on the coffee table I just didn't want too much going on so I did end up removing quite a few things that I did have on there but not too much because I just didn't want it to have a lot going on too much to ask a place forever in your arms and for this moment to let the next day clearly different outfit different wig different day I did not get to finish yesterday when Corey got home he actually got home when I was decorating and my phone ended up dying and I got it to charge a little bit to finish off the video a little bit but I still haven't finished the living room there's a couple things I still want to change around in there but I want to go ahead and do the rest of the house first so I know it's gonna take me forever in the living room. I know I'm gonna nitpick it to like yeah, that's something if you don't know about me I am a little bit OCD when I start cleaning something or just start messing with something I'll keep going and going until it's perfect in my mind. So That's another thing for another day, but yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and do the rest of the house um, Right now I'm standing in the foyer I'm gonna go ahead and start on the foyer first and then finish off the kitchen. I wanna set up our coffee buffet, make a little cute Christmas station. I still don't even have that set up yet. Like, y'all, I am so behind. But yeah, let's go ahead and get this video back on track. the front door you walk straight into the foyer and on the right of the foyer we just have a big bay window and I just have two wing back chairs set there and this table the chairs I did get from Goodwill as well there were such a still you guys they were $25 a piece and I do plan on refurbishing them I want to get some seat covers for them for now but I haven't even made up my mind of what color I want to do on them yet but we do want to change the legs on them as well just get maybe some club legs or just something a little bit different and fancier for the legs so yeah I'm just gonna go ahead and decorate that table there um, that table was a full wooden table we did add that mirror piece onto it as well as you guys can see the drawer is missing the drawer is in the garage my fiance still needs to fix it Corey I know you're watching this so I am calling you out Let's go outside, the snow is falling down And every child is having so much fun The snowman is twice the size as me With a smile as quirky as mine We're holding hands to keep each other warm While we stand and watch a choir perform And all the Christmas songs that we love Yeah, all the Christmas songs that we love 
And then why we're gonna go inside and drink our chocolate by the fire Cause all I want is to spend this day with you Let me give you a Christmas A moment we'll fill with love and joy Mm-mm, so beautiful So now I'm getting ready to take down the fall decor on our entryway table. I want to go ahead and give you guys a quick look of what I did do on there this year since I did not share with you guys our fall decor for this year. But I do want to end up doing things a lot better next year. Just want to be on time when it comes to YouTube schedule time, I guess you can say. Because I was on time with normal people time, but just not YouTube time like this video. I am putting it up on the 20th today I'm actually doing my voiceover today but I did record everything on the second week of December and I was just having so much technical difficulties getting this video up for you guys but I did get a DIY video up in the meantime because all I want is to spend this day with you let me give you a Christmas moment we'll fill with love and joy mm -mm, so beautiful kissing on a mistletoes baby with you i don't need any presents as long as i spend this day with you mm -mm, so beautiful kissing on a so if you guys did not see my decor haul, the pillow candles that I have on just the big candle holders are from Crackle Barrel and the small pillow candles I got from Dollar Tree, believe it or not, they're actually called the bougie candles. I do have a set of gold and silver. I ended up changing out the gold for the silver. You'll see that later on in the video. The sign that I got that says it's the most wonderful time of the year with the deers on there is from Dollar Tree and the light up pictures I actually made last year in a DIY video for YouTube that never went up because I never started my channel last year. The light up Christmas trees I got from Goodwill. I think I paid a little bit over a dollar for them so yeah such a good deal and that Christmas present box that I have in the middle of those deers I also got from Goodwill and the deers are from Walmart and the candle holder that I have is also from Walmart and I just put some pine cones in there and also a candle that I have from Walmart as well from the Better Home and Garden in the scent Fresh Cut Frasier. <music> tablecloth that I had from Dollar Tree from last year down to kind of mimic as a table runner for me so I can see if I wanted to do a table runner or not. I did not have one yet but you guys will eventually see me just completely scratching that thought and removing it completely because I do like how the table looks without it. And if you guys did not see my decor haul, these are my candle holders that I picked up from Kirkland's this year. I'm so super excited to use them, you guys. I've been dying to put these on the dining room table. And these are definitely something I feel like I'm going to keep year round because they're just so beautiful and they make such a statement piece. So I do have some LED candles that I got from Big Lots last year that I'm going to go ahead and put in them. But you guys will see that I ended up realized that I bought the wrong size batteries for them. So you won't get to see them light up here, but you will get to see it in the outro video because I did make sure to go ahead and get some batteries before I film that part. Still sometimes I wonder if you're near or off yonder Though I couldn't tell you why But wherever you are, near or off far Outside my door or in some different bar I still wish you the baby
to do to finish decorating that night was just to set up our coffee buffet and our kitchen and just fluff the wreaths on the doors. So I'm not even gonna lie to you guys, this buffet did take me a little over 30 minutes. I think it was because it was getting really late and I was just getting sleepy and tired and my brain was starting to become deprived of decorative juices, I guess you can say, because it was just, I don't know, but it was just something about it. It was like beating me up, you guys. I'm not even kidding. But yeah, I did eventually end up getting it to my liking. Um, if you guys are wondering why do we have three coffee machines, these were all housewarming gifts, not from this house, but our previous home, our previous apartments, the Keurig and the Mr. Coffee Frappuccino machine, my dad got that for us. And the bun was given to us by a family friend. And if you guys don't have a bun, it's honest to God, the best coffee maker ever. It makes your coffee in five minutes. I'm not even kidding. As long as it's warm up, it makes the coffee so fast. You don't have to wait 10 minutes, 15 minutes on your coffee maker. I just feel like it's something everybody should have in their home. So if you're scratching your head on what to get somebody this year for Christmas and they love to drink coffee, then you might want to consider getting them a bun. They're a little over $100, so not too bad, but not too cheap as well. Christmas to you. surprised me with flowers I ended up putting one of them on my computer desk and the roses I did put on the coffee table you guys will see that later tomorrow it is Christmas the first for you and me another year went by but the difference this time is that ever since July I've been happier than I have ever been It's safe to say that my love for you is true Tomorrow it is Christmas The first for me and you I longed for this moment To have you for myself In a cabin out of Alright 
y'all that is it from my decorate with me slash home tour Christmas tour for 2019 don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up on your way out as well as check out the description box below I do have a couple of other videos linked down there for you guys as well I'm so sorry that I'm not getting this up till the 20th I do vow to do better for you guys next year but yeah definitely don't forget to hit that subscribe button as well on your way out and I'll catch you guys in the next one.